Good morning, everyone. Happy Saturday. You guys, it's cold. We're waking up. It's 36 degrees. That's cold. But it's Saturday. It's our weekend. Welcome to our weekend vlog. Of course, it's breakfast time. Um, you guys, we're going to do breakfast on the Blackstone. That was probably the number one recommendation when we got the Blackstone. Was everybody's, you got to do breakfast. You got to do breakfast. Um, so today, I think we're going to do bacon, and I got potatoes. So we're gonna do our own little hash brown. This will be the second time cooking on the Blackstone. Like we, if you watched um, a few vlogs ago, we did cheesesteaks. Those turned out excellent. So I'm excited to eat this breakfast and Jack gets to cook. Yes. <laughs> I love how it's 37 degrees out and I have to go outside and cook. Yep, have fun. How's that fair? Good morning, Ace. Good morning, Jack. Dice them, soak them, dry them, put them in the microwave for three minutes. And then I diced up some, this will be for Mason and I, Jack won't eat that, but Jack's got all the seasonings outside. And then I think I'll do eggs inside because we don't have the egg um, little silicone things that you can get for the Blackstone. That's something that we probably need to get for the Blackstone. Yeah, I guess We're problem. like, what do we need? We need this, we need this. Um, that way, because if you do, I don't know. The perfect little round eggs you need the little silicone thing so maybe we'll we'll search for that this weekend at some point but i'm excited oh my heck you guys it smells good out here sizzle sizzle the veggies getting all nice and toasty i'm excited yes i'm outside with a blanket on because <laughs> it's cold yum good morning child good morning did you smell breakfast i did Jack just brought it inside and it smells so good. All right, here we go. The potatoes. Yum. And then we got the bacon. We got toast, eggs, all the things, an omelet for Mason, orange juice. We're eating good for breakfast this Saturday. Woo wee, breakfast was amazing. Thanks, Jack. It was good. Um, got breakfast all cleaned up. I have to laugh, there was a comment one time. I said, the kitchen's all cleaned. We don't put all of our dishes in our dishwasher. We hand wash some things. So when I say it's clean, like those are clean, they're just air drying, and then we will put them away once they're done air drying. But that was just, it was one of the comments that I was just like, oh my gosh. Anyways, we love you, but some of your guys' comments sometimes makes us, uh, what's happening over here? <laughs> all right, you guys. I don't know what the boys are doing, but it is time to give the doggo a bath because you stink. You're a stinky boy. You're a you stinky, stinky boy. boy. You okay? He does have, yeah, I don't know. Mason was playing with the dog. That's why he's down on the ground. But he does have an appointment coming up at the end of this month. It, <laughs> I called forever ago. Um, his groomers, they book out. And I, I know better. I need literally, I probably need to just make an appointment as soon as I pick him up from his hair appointment so that he doesn't get this um, floofy. <laughs> but I think we're gonna go ahead and give him a bath because he still has like three weeks until his hair appointment. So, and he's uh, smelling like a dog. He actually smells like dust. Are you an Arizona dog? You smell like dust. You okay? You want a bath? You want a bath? Yeah, bath. You remember what that is? All right, so we're gonna give him a bath and then we will get dressed for the day. Mason eventually is leaving us for the day again. He's a teenager, you guys. He's never gonna be around. Once he gets his license, I think it's even gonna be worse. We also have a plate crate and a soccer crate, so stay tuned. As soon as we get the dog showered, bathed, us ready for the day, we will open those before. <laughs> Let's see that, that bed head. <laughs> Speaking of needing a shower. This kid's hair, it's crazy, you guys. Baseball season, he doesn't wanna cut it. Maybe after, no, I think I'm gonna convince them to get a trim soon, hopefully, we will see. Do you feel better, Ace? He was a good boy. Got one clean pet, and now I need to clean the fish tank, and all my pets will be good to go. Look at that wet face. Ace, your curls are coming out. Are you so handsome? And then he'll air dry and then eventually I'll brush them out. Good boy. All right, but before Mason leaves for the day, I said earlier that he has dun dun dun, plate crate, dun dun dun, soccer crate to open. So we're gonna do that before he leaves. 
Mason, before you open these two crates, tell them what they need to do. Use our promo code. And what's our promo code? Bevo10. Ah, very good. And links are always down below. Ten dollars off. To get your ten dollars off your first play crate or soccer, da -da -da -da, crate. soccer crate. Woo! Which one are we doing? The one at the bottom. Soccer. Okay. Soccer crate. You ready? I'm ready. Soccer's in season. Although season's about to end for us. Yep. You ready? Looks like right here. Oh, these are lace bands, so you put these over your shoes in so, soccer. Oh, it okay. Keeps, like, your laces so your so shoes don't untied. come untied? That's smart. Oh, that's really cool. I've seen soccer players. Yeah? Okay. Ranch pretzels. Oh, pretzels. Okay, not seeds, but pretzels. Ooh, pretzels. Ranch flavors. Hey, no matter what sport, you can only snack on some pretzels. We got, looks like a little shaker cup. Ooh, I like the design on that. Okay, soccer. It's like their logo. Uh huh. Got a little SC for soccer crate. Pull it out. Mm -hmm. That's nice. It's like we got something from Bandit Sports. Ooh, Mason gets quite a few Bandit Sports stuff in his play crate. So let's yeah. see what they're offering for the soccer crate. I already know what oh, it is. Oh, is it Yeah. Oh, shoot. we were just talking right? about that. Yep. Yep. Mason, that's how we're trying to get him faster. He does, he runs sprints with his parachute. Sticker wall, little sticker. SC soccer crate. So we got some cones. Cones are very useful for soccer. Any sport, really. Yeah. Soccer you can use them with your speed shoe. Yeah. For agility. Agility, quick turns. And then we got the classic soccer ball. Really? Looks like there's actually there's soccer actual soccer. You need to get that. Yeah, I can, I'll work on that. And then there's a pump inside of there too. It says. Really? What? Yeah. Well, we can always use extra pumps around the the Bevo house. That's for sure. Yes. Really? That's a nice. go pop. That's awesome. That is awesome. Mason actually keeps one of those in his basketball bag, so he can always pump up his basketball. Oh no. It's a soccer ball. <laughs> I, think, I think it's a little flat there, son. Yeah, it doesn't really work. <laughs> oh, yeah. You might want to pump it up. When yeah, you get probably. Yours. Just a thought. But. All right. Sure, sure it's a ball. Oh. Okay. Oh. It's there a hat. And I'm like keeping it. this hat for me. <laughs> I like it. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> we got a shirt. Ooh, awesome. that's awesome. It's like a cream. Your logo. That's really nice. <laughs> Why are you guys laughing? Sorry, I can't, I can't laugh. <laughs> right, so that was January's soccer crate. I know we're in February. We're a little bit behind on opening these, but um. Like we said below, if you're into soccer, you have a soccer player in the family, go ahead and hit that link and we can give you $10 off your first soccer crate. You get all of this stuff. All it's a great deal. Yeah. All right. Push that around. Next, we Next. got the classic play crate, the OG, since day one. The theme? Flip. Okay. As I say, a cheat sheet, a little golden ticket. Mm -hmm. Every play crate. Got another sticker, plate crate, sticker wall. Another bandit sports item, a react baseball. Pull it out. It's like a bouncy ball. It's like a. Um... Is it weighted? Yeah, it is. You it's like Ace is going to see that weighted. and be like, ooh. Yeah. yeah. Next, we got more pretzels. Ranch. Oh, we're gonna have pretzels for days. Yum. Oh, more cones, baby. Okay. Oh, Ace, did you see the ball? So, yeah. I have 12 cones. Very six good. Six. Better get the training. I will. A lanyard. Oh, that's nice. Yep. Somebody's gonna have car keys here soon. A little play crate. You're gonna put your car keys Any on a lanyard or a regular keychain? Mm. Uh, lanyard problem. Probably a lanyard. Seems seems to be the move, Jack. What'd you do? Keep going. I, I had a regular keychain, but it seems keychain. like kids are using lanyards nowadays. We got a necklace. Ugh. <laughs> you hit the gym? <laughs> I got it. Oh, yeah. Got a little necklace? I won't put it on, but there you go. I see that. That's how it would be appear. Oh, that's cool. The shirt, obviously. 
There's always the shirt. That's the good thing about it. You're rocking it. Yeah. I like it. There you go. Ooh, Ooh I like the back. Play crate, play crate, play crate, play crate. Play That's crate. nice. That's a tongue twister. I might have to steal that one. Play crate, play crate, play crate. Flip up the shirt. Wait, what? The bottom part. Oh, yeah. Bam! <laughs> What's it say? Keep going. Keep going. So a reminder to yourselves when you... You're using your uh, shirt to wipe your sweat, oh, <laughs> especially yeah, here in cool. Phoenix. <laughs> Reminder to keep going. I Is it stuck know. on you? <laughs> you need help. <laughs> oh no. Ace, nothing for you this time. Sorry. <laughs> thank thank you. you, Play oh, Crate. Thank you, Soccer Crates. Um, links down below. Make sure you guys are using that link. Save yourself some money. You have fun today. Thank you. He set it off, I think, to like a birthday get together or something. So we probably won't see him till later tonight. You be a good kid, make good choices. Pretty soon you guys will be Can driving and I'm gonna be like stressing. Can I bring this? If you want. Woo! You gonna babysit Ace for us today? Not when he's all wet like that. <laughs> he needs to dry still. <laughs> they find a new toy. The soccer ball from the soccer crate. Ace is enjoying it. Get it, Ace. <laughs> Who's winning, Ace or Jack? Oh, oh goal. <laughs> He's trying to pick it up. Oh, he did it. That's funny. Actually, not too bad out. Ended up being a beautiful day. A little chilly, but tomorrow is supposed to be in the oh. 70s again. Oh. Get it, Ace. You're going to tire him out. Does that count as his hands or his feet? I don't know. I think that's his hands. <laughs> I think so. He's still a little bit wet from his oh. um, bath oh. earlier today. Oh, that was terrible. <laughs> he loves it. You tired? Yeah. <laughs> You should have start your watch. Is there a soccer? Probably. Probably. There's a basketball one. He always starts his watch when um, to close his rings when he plays basketball with Mason. Maybe I can make Ace a soccer player. There you go. We certainly could make Mason one. <laughs> we tried. Uh, Jack and I are just sitting here trying to figure out what we're going to do for the rest of our night. Like I said, Mason is not home. Um, so maybe we'll go out to dinner. I said I want to go see a movie. I want to go see Scream. I don't know. But I think the movie starts at 6.30, so I need to check to see if there's seats available. Do you want to go see Scream? <laughs> Just trying to figure out something to do with our evening. Look at us, Jack. We're out of the house. <laughs> we got off the couch. Um, started to get a little hungry, so we are going to do some Cafe Rio. Um, and then, you guys, so Crumble Cookies, I'm pretty sure that they have banana cream pie cookies. If you guys know, what this guy's favorite dessert is banana cream pie. It's not even close. Or like banana cream pudding. Banana like pudding, yeah. All those things. So, I think after here, we're going to go across the street and check out Crumble Cookie. So, we've done Crumble Cookie once and weren't really huge fans fan of it that like, was good the problem was is we got it and we were in a position where we had to like we were really full and we had to eat and them we had to eat it because it was, it was stay in the car for a while summertime we in arizona yeah. we and we would have had we doing yeah we would have had we were shopping yeah so i stuffed my face we with were them, over so by that, we were over by westgate um over by where the cardinals play and we were doing some shopping so yeah. the cookies would have melted and so we it had was to, good but i was like she said we were already full but we had never driven past or seen one we'd heard about it so i'm like we got to try it so we're so gonna try our them mistake. again. We got way too many cookies. And yes, we will get a cookie for Mason. So when he comes home, unless it's amazing, then we'll just never tell him about this. So I'll just, <laughs> you're gonna eat them. <laughs> Mason, hopefully you don't watch this part of the vlog. <laughs> All right, but first, before dessert, we need to eat real food. So somewhere under that salad is a tostada. Yeah, <laughs> so much for eating light, but they do have. They're already in takeouts, I guess. So we can get lids because we got to save room for the crumbles. Absolutely. <laughs> Did you eat your cookies already? Not yet. <laughs> you guys, we are home. Bam! We got them. You guys ready? Dun, dun, dun. So that's why we went. Well, those do look good. All right, so these are cold. 
chilled cookies, banana cream pie. This is a traditional chocolate chip, which I think they keep warm, right? Yeah, it's warm. And then the Oreo is also warm, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we had to drive a little bit, so not quite warm, but we could always zap them in the microwave or air fryer. I don't know. I don't know. So are you gonna try it now or are you full from dinner? I don't know. Thinking about it? They look amazing. I think so. we need to at least try one of these right I think now. That's what's gonna happen. So Crumble does make a thing. Did you see it, Jack? It cuts the cookie into fours. Because oh, I think you're smart. only supposed to have a fourth of a cookie. Uh, they don't know me very well. Crumble. <laughs> <laughs> it's terrible, you shouldn't. <laughs> I thought you were gonna be serious about that. Just because the last time we weren't like, I don't even remember the flavors that they had. I know we tried the chilled one, the sugar cookie. It was way too sweet. Good. Good? Mm. Is it sweet? It's banana. It, does it have chunks of real banana? That's what she I told us. A chunk of banana. Yeah. yeah. What's it look like inside? Oh, yeah. So that, is it like pie down there then? It's almost like a banana cream pie. It's got like sugar, sugar cookie exterior. Like the banana cream on the inside, bananas, and then the um, dill wafers. All right. So, so you would get it again? Absolutely. All right, yeah. there you go. I knew you would like this one. Mm -hmm. Good morning. Happy Sunday fun day. We are up. Already had breakfast. Jack already took the dog for a nice long walk. Um, I'm in the middle of trying to get dressed and do laundry at the same time. But I think the boys are better to head out to do a little driving and a bullpen. Looking for a mound, but if not, we'll just figure something out. Okay. Well, hopefully, because Mason really needs to get his arms start or ready for baseball season. Not started. His arms already. Well, going. his okay. Make sure his arm is ready. Is that what I need to say? Yes. <laughs> okay. All right. Have fun, Mace. <laughs> He's also making plans for the day, so he needs to get all this. Well, he also did chores this morning too. So, thumbs up for that, Mason. Thank you for cleaning your bathroom. Good boy. But I think he's gonna get all this done, and then he wants to hang out with friends again tonight. So. All right, I'm gonna pass off the camera to you, see if you can maybe get some clips. Okay. Have fun. Well, you guys, a package just arrived for, I think you, right? Yes, me. <laughs> um, so, we noticed out back our Blackstone, um, that propane tank just is not great to look at, right? Right, it sticks out like a sore thumb, it's basically. <laughs> yes. Right. And as soon as so, I put it together, I'm like, this propane tank's probably gonna be hideous. So last weekend when we were shopping at like Home Depot, okay? Jack saw you okay? a propane cover and he didn't get it. And then I came, we came home and we were grilling on our Blackstone and I was like, yeah, we need that. So we ordered it. Yeah, thankfully I didn't get that one because this one I think is way better. Way so, better, and yeah. I don't know, prices, I mean we got it from Amazon, so. Basically the propane tank sits in here and it kind of doubles as another table because yeah. that's another issue you're having out there. There's no space to put, you know, your oils and seasonings and yeah, whatever you're Yeah, so I need another cooking. table because I leave, well, I leave the cover on, the other, on my grill, otherwise I would have like a little another mini table, mm -hmm. but I don't want to take the cover off just for a table. Yeah. But it's more to hide the tank, but it's going to double as a useful little table. Little table. And then I just got back from Walmart and picked up, they had flowers for like a dollar for outside. I'm going to plant some flowers, some spring flowers out front because you guys, I'm pretty sure we're going into spring now because this week coming up, we have 80 degrees in the weather. <laughs> Bring on spring training. Hopefully, you guys, do you think we're gonna have spring training? Oh gosh, I hope so. Jack, do you have anything to say about that? Don't ruin my summer, MLB, MLB players. Figure Association. it out. Figure it out. Well, you have fun putting together your little propane tank table thingy. And I think I'm gonna go out front and plant some flowers. Good luck. Thanks. Wait, who needs the luck, you or me? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Look who came home just in time for dinner. Smash burgers. <laughs> yes, we are doing smash burgers on the Blackstone for the first time, so we'll see if they turn out. And I actually have homemade french fries, like I sliced up the potatoes um, in the air fryer. Haven't done that yet before either, so hopefully those turn out. Did you have a fun night? I guess afternoon? Yeah. Yeah, all right. And Ace? Ace is looking handsome. Look. He's got his Valentine's. Oh, you want to hug, bro? You want to? He says, hug me. Yes, hug me. Oh. Do you want to take the camera out and see if Dad's smashing the burgers? Sure. All right. Fresh burgers. 
Can you even see it? Yes. There you go. Onions. Burgers. Yes. The buns. Some Smash TV. burgers. First time. Hopefully it's not going to happen. Hopefully fail. you do good, bro. <laughs> I believe. You got it. All right, there's our smash burgers and grilled onions and toasty buns and my french fries. They look good too. We're gonna eat and I'm excited. Oh, you guys, that was probably, I just told Jack, that was probably the best burger that I had at this house ever. Thank you. I don't know if I'm complimented or insulted. <laughs> well, <laughs> or both. <laughs> um, but yeah, that was so good and I'm really full now. We had teamwork, so he cooked dinner, I did some side dishes, and then Mason cleaned the dishes. Once again, these are clean by he Mason. He dishwasher before dinner He too. did, so. Very helpful. Now we can relax on the rest of our Sunday night. Uh, don't mind the air fryer, it's cleaning right now. Mason, did you have a good weekend? Yeah. You ready to go back to school tomorrow? Big week for this kid, stay tuned. Don't forget to like this video, comment something in the comment section, subscribe. As always, thanks for watching. We will see you next time.